Hey guys, what's up? I'm Kishin and welcome to my channel. Today, we got a little tea to spill. We have a little exposing to do. And it's all about this brand called Tony Dash Cosmetics. They are basically a scam. So I'm gonna get into all of it, the reasons why they are and what they have been doing. So make sure you subscribe to my channel and if you want to hear all about this stuff, then keep on watching. About a month or so ago, I was scrolling through Facebook. I saw an ad that said, free lipstick. All you gotta do is pay the shipping. So a few months ago, I did a video about hair extensions, which was kind of the same situation. Free hair extensions, just pay the shipping. So I was like, okay, well, let's do round two. We'll order this lipstick. We'll make another video. We'll see what's popping with this brand. I went ahead, made an order. I ordered a lipstick. It was a, like, I think it was like some red one or whatever. You know, immediately after I order the lipstick, I get an email saying that, oh, they're all sold out and that they're working very hard to make more product and that they will keep me updated. Oh, how funny that as soon as I give you my money, I mean, which I only had to pay like $5 for the shipping, which is, that's not that much. But it's like, as soon as I do that, it's like, oh, you don't have anything available. Oh, and even in this email, in the screenshots, it like has like, I'll post that here like, oh, waiting shipment, and there's like 3,000 people waiting for the shipment or whatever. And before you're like going through the process of ordering your thing, it's constantly popping up to, oh, do you want this free VIP kit? Just pay the shipping, blah, 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 blah. I kind of did do a little bit of searching on the company before I um, made the purchase or whatever. And I did see a lot of people were like, this is a scam, blah, 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 but I wanted to try it out for myself and really see so I can put together this video and, you know, possibly warn other people. So let me find those screenshots. Here's one of them. It's like VIP free makeup kit. I'll post that here. It's worth $56. It includes a lipstick, lip stain, and lip pencil. Just cover the shipping and handling. I opted for no, because I had read some other things about what other people were saying. Like, it literally, you probably get like two or three pop-ups before you even finish your order to get you to get more stuff. Some of the things that I've noticed online that people have been saying is that that little VIP kit was not free whatsoever. What they said was, Oh, like, you know, just pay the shipping. Well, shipping on this VIP kit turns out to be like 20 bucks. And so you're technically getting charged for it, right? So when you email the company and you ask them about it, their excuse is that, oh, well, the kit is worth $56 and you got a great deal. That's not what you said on the website. In these pop-ups, you said, it's free. Just pay the shipping. You're very misleading already. So that already has people pissed off as it is. And not only that, some people are not even getting the products they ordered. I would say the majority of people haven't got the products they ordered. I haven't got the products that I ordered. So where is this, you know, this money, where is it going to? The, the company is keeping it. They're not sending shit out. And they're advertising that they have this product, but they don't. So even for some of the people who did receive their products, uh, I can post some screenshots, they said it was either not even the correct order or that the product looked used or old and it was pretty much dollar store quality. This company has been scamming people so much that there's literally a Facebook page now called Tony Dash Cosmetics Scam. And a lot of people are on there, they're sharing stories. This page is just bringing an awareness to this brand, like don't waste your money on them, don't get scammed by them. One of the things that they're completely misleading on is that in their ads that they have scrolling through when you have on Facebook, they're using very popular beauty gurus as if they like to advertise their products, but these beauty gurus are not even 
like using their product in their videos. For example, I have this screenshot right here, and this is from Tati, she's super popular on YouTube. It's a screenshot of a video where she's applying lipstick, and, it, and the quote on top of the video is like, oh my god, I just got my free makeup, and now all my friends are freaking out. Bitch, all your friends are freaking out because we all got motherfucking scammed. But anyway, so Tati in this video is not even using their product. This is a screen get a grab from her using Tattoo Junkies lipsticks. Like, and someone even asked her on Twitter if you know she was doing this, and this was her. Um, this is what she said had to say about it. She's like, I'm all for empowering women, but I was testing the tattoo junkie in this video. Using my image without permission on an ad is not cool. Tricking consumers is even worse. Stop. Which they need to be stopped. It's like a lot of people, they trust what Tati has to say, and they're going to see Tati as like the face of this brand, and they're going to think that it's trustworthy, and it's just disgusting. Like, that is gross. And there's a lot of people that don't have tons of money to order like makeup and it's just like so you get pulled into this because you're like yeah you get excited and it's just a scam and you're just going to be disappointed if with the product even if you even get it you know during this time that the month that i have been waiting for my product to come in i've gotten emails like of like random reviews like of people saying oh my god i love it and like i'm like bitch no, that is like, like I want, I want to try it then. It's like, where's mine? And I asked them, I emailed them and asked them where their product was. And they're like, oh, we're just so busy, like blah, blah, blah. Like, just like, they just come up with bullshit. Straight up asked them if they were a scam. And then this is what they had to say. Hi, Christian. There's definitely no scam here at Tony Dash. We take our customers very seriously. I'm very sorry for the wait, but due to the overwhelming demand of the promo, we are experiencing some delays in sending them out. Rest assured, we are doing our best in sending them out as soon as possible. So, which is bullshit. I want to go ahead and just bring up some stuff from th that Facebook page and just like some of the things that other people have been saying. Uh, if you go and put anything negative on the Tony Dash Cosmetics Facebook page, that they will go ahead and delete your comment and mark it as spam. I have like scrolled through and it'll be like, oh, a thousand comments, but then you'll go there and there'll be five because they've deleted every other comment on there that is not a positive one. I'm scrolling through their page right now and apparently there's a phone number you can call on their website. So I'm just going to say, let's just go ahead and call right now and, and see if anyone picks up and let's ask some questions. Thank you for calling. To speak to a representative, please press zero. All right. Thank you for calling. Please leave a message and your call will be returned as soon as possible. Hmm. That's what you get, guys. There's no customer service set up for this brand. Um, basically, you call and you're gonna get that. You can't even talk to a real person. So I'm gonna go ahead and link the Facebook page below in the description of this video. That way you guys can go ahead and read through some of the stories that these girls are saying. Another thing that someone has posted is that they had to go through 30 emails just to get a refund. Like, that is ridiculous. And it's like, you can't get anyone on the phone. A lot of these women on here, they've already um, reported them to the Better Business Bureau and they already have like an awful rating on there. So I found this so interesting because I remember, you know, I did the video on the Bell hair extensions and they were really shitty. A lot of people did complain about not getting theirs and this person just said that Tony Dash and Slide LLC are the same. Slide LLC is also affiliated with Bell Hair. Oh my god! And it's like Bell Hair was scamming people or giving them really shitty products, and this lipstick company is doing the same. And if you go onto the 
the Tony Dash Cosmetics website. There's like an about me and it's some bitch that gives a story like, I was working in a boutique and didn't like the product, so I made my own. Like, yeah, I made some dollar store shit. <laughs> Woo! Both of these companies, they're sister companies and they're scamming all over the place. One of their excuses when you ask for a refund is that they're like, oh, well, you didn't pay for any product. You just paid for the shipping. So you have to go and ask um, USPS for a refund. And it's like, bitch, because that's not the way it works. When you are paying, when you pay a company, you pay them for the shipping because then they're going to turn around and pay USPS or whoever else that they're going through shipping for. But I'll post a screenshot. This is literally from their website that says you have to go ask USPS for the refund. Like, bitch. And you know what? They're still advertising free makeup. Like, literally right after like I got the email that they didn't have any product left, they're like still advertising free makeup, free makeup, pay shipping. So it's like, stop advertising if you don't have the product. You're ripping people off and you're being highly misleading. So bottom line here is, screw Tony Dash Cosmetics. It's a huge scam. Warn all your friends. If you see that coming across your Facebook feed, ignore it. Don't order from them. There's plenty of other companies out there that offer a good quality product for that is, you know, for, for as much as the shipping is, like you can get a wet and wild liquid lipstick and it's good and it's cheap. So it's like, just go to your wa local Walgreens and pick it up. Like you don't need to order through Tony Dash. They're just gonna scam you. They're gonna take your money. They're not gonna send you anything. And if they send you something, it's gonna be some dollar store quality lipstick. Like, nah. If I actually get the lipstick in the mail, I will go ahead and make a follow-up video, but I don't, I highly doubt that I'm gonna get it. Like, I highly doubt that anything's gonna come in the mail. I got scammed. I mean, at least it was only $5, and I mostly did it because I wanted to test this out for myself and just show you guys. That's all I really have to say. If you guys have any questions, just let me know in the comments. And you know, please subscribe to my channel if you like this video. You know, hit the like button. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.